Hello everybody and welcome back to Arson Girl Gaming. My name is Heather and you are joining me for another Sims Free Play Let's Play. And today is going to be a fun one because we're starting a new quest. And that is the Dream Closet Quest. And I was waiting for you before I did anything. So let's take a look at what this is. We have seven days to unlock custom closets and design the closet of our dreams and become a modern savant of style. Collect craft items to unlock new wardrobe components and customize your closet to your heart's content. <laughs> craft items. Means I'll probably be using LPs for this. Sorry to you guys that don't have a bunch, but you know, you can always buy them. Um, however, I'm going to try. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to try to not use LPs. That is my goal because I definitely spend them faster than I earn them and I don't want to spend more money buying them. So, um, oh boy, and we can do no time extensions for this. That's not good. All right, so let's see. It says, you, you progress in the Custom Closets live event by collecting arts and crafts items. Oh, that's new, right? You'll need a crafting station for that. Go to the event ta items tab of the home store and place a candle station on a home lot. All right. Well, let's see. What home lot should I do it? Should I just go do my main home lot? Probably. All right. And let me collect all these little peas bees and okay so you guys I'm gonna show you this really quick if you're my friend on here and if you want to be my friend you can look below this video and I will try to remember to have all of my social links there you can friend me on Facebook um, or actually, and that my Facebook might not be in there. If it's not, leave me a comment and I will give you my Facebook. And then you can friend me. And then if you come to my town, this little house right here that says it has nine peoples in it, that house should have pretty much everything you need um, for any quest that you have for friends, it should. If it doesn't, it's up to you guys to let me know what's missing. I went through and I tried to think of everything. Um, it's kind of a crazy house, but it's probably missing something. And if it is, just let me know and I'll add it. But let's go in where this exclamation point is and find our candle station, which is right here. And should we just put it in the middle of this teen girl's room since it's so big and open? I say yes. All right, so we've placed a crafting station. Now that you have a crafting station, your sim can make arts and crafts items to unlock prizes in the Custom Closets live event. Have a sim make some candles from a candle station. All right, let's do it. So we can have four of these. I might need to make a room to have these in, but for right now, Let's have a sim come and make 50 candles. And that is 23 seconds. Let's go ahead while they're doing that and let's... Oh, look at this, guys. Look, 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 look. We're gonna get more stations. We need like a whole craft house. I'm so excited. Okay, candle station, pottery station, jewelry station, and glassware station. Oh, this is gonna be so fun. I love stuff like this. All right, so... I may get rid of this bedroom and just turn this bedroom into a crafting room. What do you guys think? Let's do that and then I'll be right back. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Thank you. 
All right, so we have 50 candles. We are well on our way. Look at that. All right, so, oh, and we've got our Reflection Eternal. Your Sim can admire their newfound styles for eternity in these exquisite mirrors. Perfect. Yes, I do, thank you. Congratulations, you've unlocked the Reflection Eternal Pack. Find your new mirrors in the bedroom section of the home store. Awesome. Next is the plush lounge. We need 750 candles and five of those dang event tokens, which I hate doing, but okay. Occasionally, you may need to restock arts and craft stations with supplies. The candle station just ran out and needs to be restocked. Have a sim perform the restock action on a candle station. Okay. Restock two uses. Okay, and while they're restocking, Oh, we got a coin flower patch. Let's go ahead and put that outside. Right there. And let's do some more candle stations. Or, wait a minute. So now it says use a coin flower patch. Constructor coins are needed to get items in this event. The best way to earn them is with a coin flower patch. Find one in the event tab at the home store and plant a spin flower on it. So we already um, planted it or made it. So let's go plant one. We get one free one. How much are they gonna cost? Probably 20 LPs. Let's see what we get. One of each gives us one constructor coin. Man, are we lucky. Okay, fantastic. So we can use candles to spin or we can buy with um, social points. So we'll have to see how that goes over the course of the next seven days. Now we can check our daily goals. You can earn extra rewards to help you in this event by completing daily goals. Go to the daily goals tab of the event screen to see what they are. Some may already be completed. All right, there's our event screen. Here's our custom closets. Here's our daily goals. We can craft an item so that gave us a coin. Use a spin plant that gave us a coin. Unlock or buy a prize that gave us a coin. We need to do a thousand items. Win 10 coins. Complete all daily goals. Free candles. Free constructor coins. All right, so we get those every day it looks like. So that's cool. And that's our inventory there. These are all the goodies, which we'll look at closer as we get through them. Oh, this actually could be a pretty fun event. So we shall see. But for right now, let's get some people. Oh, I want to get some more candle stations. Collect bonuses. To collect arts and crafts items faster, check in regularly and tap the icons floating above your sim's head for a bonus. Have a sim collect arts and crafts items from any crafting station. Wait a few minutes. When you see the icon above their head, tap it. All right, let's go upstairs. Do we have an icon? Well, I don't even know where she went. There she is. Nope, that's Grandma. Grandma just finished her quilt. Where did you go, little one? What's this? Oh. Laura will help you make arts and crafts for the entire duration of the event. Five bucks to buy her. And I'm thinking, no thank you. All right. Great, Grandma, you did a fantastic job on your quilt. Congratulations. Now, where did my arts and craftsy girl go? I'm pretty sure it was... Brandy, where are you, Brandy? And I don't see any bonus floating above her head. So I think it's safe to go back to the store and buy some more crafting stations. Let's do that. Can I do another coin flower patch? For reals? I, don't, I can. I don't know what good it's going to do me, but we'll put it there. Still, oops. All right, 
let's move this to this corner. How can we have these best organized? Probably like that. Let's put you away. And we can do four of these, so we shall. And then let's get our little peeps up here working on candles. Okay, look at this. So we can make 250 candles in two and a half hours, 360 in four and a half, 510 in eight and a half, or 455 in six and a half. So I think the best one's the four and a half hour. Oh, we can't get to them. What? That should be organized well enough that they all could get there. Shouldn't it? How can I do these so they all can do what they need? Let's try this way. Oh, that's not gonna work. I just spread them out. It's not gonna be a lot of fun when we get a ton of tables in here, but we shall see what we can come up with. Let's see if this works. So we're gonna do four and a half, four and a half, four and a half. What? Why can you not get there? The stairs, maybe? Oh, I see why. I can't do them any kind of decorative way. I have to keep them like this. Oh, I wonder if I do that. Let's try. Nope. Damn it. So aggravating sometimes. All right, let's try. Go to work, my little worker bees. Go to work. Got some candle crafting going on. And let's see, since that's all we can do right now, what do we got? Do we have a free social point? Who am I trying to do? Why can't you do it? I have a free one. Plant, girl, plant. All right, never mind. Let's just find her a four hour plant and see if I can get her to do that. Okay, thank you. Get everybody else working on four hour plants here. And we're off to a good start for our little event here. So next milestone, 592 items. So that should get us pretty close to something. That would get us a constructor coin probably. Oh, I'm so excited about this. If you watch Make Two's videos, she did the little like sneak peek look at these closets and they are to die for. And they'll be perfect in my penthouse when I buy it. That's what I'm saying. All right, and I really wanna, want that girl, but I don't wanna pay five bucks for her. So, I'm not going to. Come plant, why are you just standing there? Oh, it's grandma. Do you wanna work on a quilt, grandma? Why isn't anybody behaving? Oh wait, look. Look, we have candles above our heads. We got some bonuses. Yay. Well done. Collect arts and crafts items to unlock and buy more prizes. Have Sims make items on crafting stations to get all the prizes. This end event ends in six days, 21 hours. No relief. Sorry, you better do it or you're out of luck. That's what they're telling me. So let's take a look at this little crafting station. How stinking cute is that? So cute. Love it. I'm taking a picture because it's so cute. 
Oh yeah. I'm in love. I love crafts. Love, love, love crafts. This is great. All right, so let's take a look at our latest artwork here. Wish we could sell this stuff. All right, why are you? Oh. All right. I am a ding dong doo doo today. So. Come out and play. Why are you not doing anything, girl? Walk out here. Can I not control you? What the heck? Hello? Anybody home in there? Oh, it says she's planting, but she's not planting. So, all right. So that is all far we're gonna get right now with the custom closet event. Let's go visit Warren. He is my new Sim. I bought, brought him in after I aged up Ben. And I aged up Ben because I needed an old man because I have a special little closet event coming soon, which I guess is kind of interesting because it goes along with the custom closet theme. But it is gonna be taking a look at, in several special editions, the clothing that I have in my Sims wardrobes. So I needed a an adult man and I needed like a, an elder man. So that's why uh, Warren exists. So anyway, I wanted to bring you back here. This is my friend's town. Yeah. And I just wanted to show you. So actually I'm gonna leave and I'm gonna come back so you can see the name. And if you look at the comments on my episode 10 video of The Sims Free Play, you'll actually get their Facebook name so you can friend them and then become, or not become, but have access to their house. And it is, let's see here, where are we, where are we, where are we? Takasaki Kurumi. Now, uh, the name is not the same on my comments, so look for Ren Cardeno. I hope I said that right. That is who um, you want a friend so that you can have access to this town. And they provide their email address so that you can friend them. But what they've done for me is make a house that has everything we need. So let's find Warren and we'll send him back there. And the house, when I showed it to you, I think in episode eight, it was like on a different part of town. And now it has a pool. It has been moved up here. It is this house right here, this red one. It looks unassuming, but it pretty much has what you need for the most part. I think the only thing I've noticed so far that it was missing was like a haunted item. And that was back at the old location, so it might have been added by now. And if not, then that would be a good thing to add. But look, it has everything, so cute. So, so cute. I don't think I have like these things in my house, so I might have to put those in too. But I may have to find a bigger house, or I don't know, so anyway. We've got some lifeguard chairs. We've got everything here, some slides. Just very organized, very nice. I really love this. And it just keeps getting better every time I come over. So let's see what Warren has to do today. He just made a speech. He's throwing the same thing a second time. All right, I mean, I'm down. Let's go make a speech. Oh, wait, did I do the wrong thing? Oh, I know why. I did the wrong thing. I did auctioneering. And I probably need to go to, if I remember correctly. I thought it was here where he could make speeches. No? Oh, a mirror. God, I'm a dingus today, man. 
Jeez, oh, peace. Forgive me, guys. Forgive me. I know not what I do. Okay, so let's find a mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? Where, is there not a mirror in here? Oh, look at that. Oh, there's a mirror. Nice big mirror. Oh, look at that. So cute. I guess I should probably call Warren to the house. Then we shall go take advantage of this gorgeous mirror. Wait, not the sink, the mirror. No? It's not gonna let me use the mirror. Is there another mirror here? Not the vanity. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We might be out of luck. I need a mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? My goodness. Well, I don't know what to do. Let's go look at some other houses. We have a nice gigantic mirror on that wall and it won't let me use it. So let's see if we can find a house with a usable mirror. That is such a pretty house, isn't it? Oh, there's a mirror. There's a mirror. Oh, yeah. You want to actually call your sim to the house to use said mirror. So let's do it. There we go. Practice speech. Fantastic. All right. So I need to look for some things to put into my house to make it even more usable for you guys. Like I said, though, if there's anything you come across that I don't have, let me know. And I will for sure make sure to add it. Uh, so, but anyway, yeah, so check out this neighborhood because as you see, it may not always be in the house because we're always like adding stuff, but um, you'll find it somewhere. So let's go back, let's see what everybody else is doing. Let's go to our cooking school. Everybody started hitting level six yesterday. So that's awesome. I realized too when I was at this house that I actually had another weather machine that I didn't know I had, so I made it rain and uh, it's nice and gloomy. So we can make, I'm gonna make random weather on this one just because I can. So let's go and, oh, I should probably, uh, let's go send Nicole to work. We're still working on that doctor track for her. I want Nicole to start a work shift. So, oh man. Stop working. And there we go. Too many sims. So let's send you home, Edward. Go home. We'll come back another day. Oscar got paid. Good job. That means you're done too, huh, Oscar? Let's send you home. And I guess then I can bring Edward back since he can work. There you go. Work your little heart off. Review some charts there. Okay. Let's see where we are in opening this practice. Not moving very fast, but that's all right. Let's go to the cooking school. All right, so you notice I have other people doing other tasks right now. But the ones that are here have started leveling up, so eventually we'll get there. gonna have them just do 20 minute burgers and as you can see um, from yesterday's episode we definitely have some food gathering going on here I kind of want to see if I can get these um, plates higher than my sims that would be kind of funny you have an exciting new batch of weekly goals ready why not check them out now be nice to a sim We'll do that, but not at the moment. 
Let's have Oscar come here. Let's have these guys all come and get some cooking on. Yep. We got some cooking for you guys to do. I hope you all are cooks. Pretty sure. I sent them off to work, but I'm pretty sure, yep, they all have the cooking hobby. So, let's see. I need a teenage boy. So I think I'm going to age up Todd. We're gonna have a birthday. And hmm, what do I want him to do? Karate or water slides? I think we'll do karate. And he's definitely a lot cuter as a preteen than he was as a little toddler. Let's go ahead and make Trevor have a birthday. Now we have another little toddler boy. I'm sure that's, all right, let's just make sure. One toddler boy, one baby girl. Oh, you know what? I have a toddler girl. I need a another baby boy. Can I make another baby boy? Yes, well it's not right now. There was another house that I had. Oh, and I was still working on this super toddler quest. So let's let this go on. We're almost out of time on this, so I may add some time. She says, still hesitant to spite the carrot in their hand, your toddler approaches the mass of minions at the stables. Have a toddler give a horse carrot. Let's do that. Give a carrot. Let's see how cute that is. Because this is a sweet horsey. Aww. That's so cute. So, so cute. She's adorbs. She's probably one of my favorite toddlers I've ever had. I want another picture. Oh, I want a picture with the horse's head up. There we go. So cute. Okay. So we'll let that go on. Now let's go back to this. I have a preteen boy and a preteen girl. I want one of each. And I have a toddler girl and a toddler boy and a baby girl. So I need a baby boy. And then, I have a teen girl, so I need a teen boy. So I need a couple more babies to come into this world. And I know that I was at one of my houses and I had a, whose house was I at? I was at one of my houses and I had a, Baby bed. Is it this one? Yes. All right, we're gonna add a baby. We'll let that go for now. And then, so that would give me, so I'm gonna need a teen boy. Let's age up. So what we'll do is have Stuart, who got a makeover, and he is so much cuter now. Will Stuart come to where these guys are? And eventually, where are you, Stuart? Well, you know, you try stuff and you learn. 
let's send him to work. Where does he work at? I gave him a job at the police station. Did I not get anything for that? What the hell? Why does that just disappear? Okay, I'm getting aggravated now. That was one of those long event things. Maybe I have to check back in the same day or something. All right, so let's go back to the kids hangout. Let's call. I want all my little youngins hanging out together. So we're going to go ahead and let people do or let these guys do stuff that takes them almost four hours because that'll be about as long as I have before I'll get back to the game. And I think that's everybody busy. So that's good. Except the baby. We'll let you sleep for four hours. Get some XP because we're about to level up to 48. It's pretty cool. I love these cotton candy trees. I want one. I want one. Cute babies, cute toddlers. I mean, for reals, guys. For reals. Okay, so you guys, I guess that means I'm wrapping up this episode. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Let me know you watched. And of course, if you'd like to see more and you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. YouTube will make sure you don't miss out on a thing. And I'll be back again real soon. Bye.